You know, Amit, uh, the fact of the matter is that at the end of the day, this is in fact a logjam essentially that continues. There is no way forward when it comes to the talks, isn't it? What is the way forward given that the people are getting inconvenienced? This is something that the courts also have taken note of. Oh, well, Sneha, you know, uh, the talks are going on. What uh, looks uh, positive right now is that the government is also in a mood uh, to continue these parlays, and so are the farm organizations. Yesterday, when the meeting started late in the night, you know, it was supposed to begin at 5 uh, uh, itself with the union minister, Arjun Munda, Piyush Goyal, uh, Nitanand Rai, along uh, with the delegation of the farmers who are protesting at Sambu and Kanori. Uh, but, uh, you know, the ray of hope, what we can see right now, is that uh, the farm organizations, in the government both are on a positive note they want to hold talks the Punjab government Punjab chief minister Bhagwant Man is acting as a mediator between the central government as well as uh, uh, the farmer organizations uh, what uh, the, the main contention point right now has become the MSP guarantee law. You know, the uh, government is of the opinion that a committee needs to be formed, the state needs to be consulted, the economic aspect of it, the viability of the entire model, if at all implemented, needs to be uh, checked out and chalked out and uh, without that, uh, uh, no such guarantee law can be rolled out. Uh, but the farmers are continuously saying that, look, this is not a new demand, it has been there for uh, decades now. Uh, you promised us uh, this particular aspect while we wrapped up Kisan Andolan 1.0 from Singhu, Tikri and Ghazipur. Uh, but it's been two years and uh, nothing has gone forward on that front. What we can assume is that some kind of amicable solution is made on that particular aspect as far as MSP guarantee law is concerned. Maybe a uh, you know, deadline uh, like committee formation which will submit its report uh, to the government which also has fair representation of the Sayyuk Kisan Morcha or the protesting farmers because that has been also a long-standing demand from the Sanyukt Kisan Mocha and farmer organizations that they had accused that uh, members from their organizations were not included in the committee that was uh, uh, being formed by the central government. So that's one uh, uh, bone of contention. Asnia, beyond that, you know, the MS, uh, uh, beyond the MSP guarantee law, uh, when it comes to loan waiver, it's something that I feel as per my sources within the farm organizations are indicating at it's a flexible point. They know that they will not be able to win on every front and every demand. So that particular aspect looks pretty uh, flexible. The government, in a way, in the last few meetings have ignored that particular uh, demand. Uh, uh, beyond that are, uh, uh, is a major demand of withdrawal of cases which were filed against these protesting farming groups uh, during Kisan Andolan 1.0. And uh, remember that also includes a very serious case of the uh, security violation and the kind of uh, activity that had happened at Red Fort on 26th of January. Uh, so whether that case will be withdrawn because the, uh, those uh, that particular case has very serious uh, 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 sections of the IPC in, uh, involved in the FIR. Uh, so all that needs to be uh, seen but uh, maybe by and large uh, that aspect uh, could be delivered. The Lakimpur Kiri is another uh, point where the farm organizations look very, uh, you know, uh, adamant that uh, the case needs to be uh, processed fast. The, uh, uh, the these, uh, families of uh, the victims need to be compensated. Uh, so maybe that right. angle could be looked into as well by the government and the UP government could mm -hmm. be asked or the central government uh, could carry uh, the compensation package itself. Uh, but we'll have to wait till Sunday. Uh, for the outcomes to come out or at least to, to see as to how this entire issue is progressing forward and further. Uh, what we can expect till then, that like uh, the uh, farm organizations had called for a ceasefire uh, for tomorrow's, yesterday's yes, meeting uh, at Kanori and Sambu, maybe what we can expect is that these farm organizations, yes, uh, could continue this ceasefire.